Okay guys, this is a continuation of that video. Um, what I did here was remove the whole pedal assembly from the car. It's really easy to do. There's only three bolts that hold it into the car. Uh, two there. And one at the very top that goes right up in there. So anyways, as you can see, there's the, uh, the cruise control switch once again. Um, and there is the hole. You can see it right there of where this stopper goes in. Um, as you can see this one's used and it was already breaking up. It's discolored. There's part of it missing right there. And here's the two new ones I ordered uh, from an Acular dealership down in Florida. And you can see they're white and uh, they're kind of a soft material. So anyways, yeah, there's a one goes right here, see if I can push it in by hand. Yep, I just pushed it in there. So there's that new one is installed. And the next one, you can see where the reason why it was not starting because this is where the uh, the new the new clutch switch will screw into right here. It screws in there. Obviously, when you push the clutch in, uh, this gets pushed in so the car can start. And when the clutch is released, that pops back out. So obviously this needed something to push against it, to push it in, which was going to be one of these bad boys, but that wasn't there. So all you had was a hole. So the car was not starting. And that was a very expensive hole. So yeah, I hope this is helpful. And um, I mostly just wanted to make this video here just because the first one probably wasn't explaining what was going on well enough because I was using the cruise control switch and not the actual clutch switch so yeah that's where the the clutch switch goes right in there when you press the pedal it pushes it against it allows you to start the car so there it is guys the top one's the clutch one the bottom one's the cruise control switch these little plastic things are like two dollars a piece if that and uh you know if, if you're not able to find out what the issue is it can cost you a lot of money so i spent 350 dollars for something that costs 200 dollars um the dealership sucks but uh yeah i just hope this is helpful guys uh thanks for watching and take care